robbed at gunpoint for their instruments, ticketed for unloading their gear in a loading zone. These are just a few concerns musicians who perform on Lower Broadway tell us they face. News Channel 5's Kelsey Gibbs is live on Broadway, and Kelsey musicians actually met with the mayor's office to discuss these matters. That's exactly right, Rory. Now, we were told that both sides, both sides walked away reassured, but musicians say if no action is taken to better secure their security, there could be lights out here on Broadway. One, two, check, one, two, check, hey. Music is light for Sasha McVeigh. Right Originally from England, McVeigh moved to the one place she believed was worth singing about. It's a great place to learn your craft, um, learn how to interact with the audience, and just meet incredibly talented musicians. She's talking about Lower Broadway. But today, she is singing a different tune about Music City. Musicians have been robbed at gunpoint or knife point. McVeigh says as much as she loves this city, there needs to be changes. This isn't just a musician issue. It is a bartender issue. It is a sound engineer issue. And it's a public safety issue. She says musicians are being forced to park far while carrying expensive instruments down dark streets. If they use loading zones, McVeigh says they're hit with a ticket. She says this needs to stop. We need to show the mayor's office, the government, Metro, every faction that's involved in this that so many people are concerned. McVeigh started a petition with thousands of signatures asking for safer parking and the use of loading zones for musicians and not cabs. She and other musicians met with the mayor's office and she's confident changes will happen soon. That door is now open. They want to do something. They told us they want to do something. Well, the, a spokesperson with the mayor's office telling us that the conversation was very productive and served as another opportunity for the mayor's office to listen to and discuss their concerns. Reporting live in Lower Broadway, Kelsey Gibbs, News Channel 5. Thanks, Kelsey.